This video contains calculation of new strength of potassium permanganate solution that is standardization calculation and preparation of 50 ppm manganese stock solution. Please click on i icon above for standardization procedure. In previous video, we perform standardization titration of potassium permanganate and sodium oxalate and we found following results. Amount of sodium oxalate taken in beaker are 0.1999 gram, 0.1423 gram, 0.1004 gram, 0.0511 gram, 0.0012 gram and we also perform blank titration. In titration, 0.1999 gram sodium oxalate solution consumes 29.5 ml potassium permanganate. 0.1423 gram consumes 20.6 ml 0.1004 gram consumes 14.7 ml 0.0511 gram consumes 7.5 ml 0.0012 gram consumes 0.3 ml and blank consumes 0.1 ml potassium permanganate solution from these values, we have to calculate normality of potassium permanganate solution. Normality of potassium permanganate solution is calculated by following formula. Normality of KMN4 equals sodium oxalate taken in gram divided by A minus B multiplied by 0 0.06701. where A is the volume of potassium permanganate solution consumed by sodium oxalate in ml. B is the volume of potassium permanganate solution consumed by blank in ml. First, we have to calculate individual normalities given by different grams of sodium oxalate solution. So, normality of potassium permanganate given by 0 0.1999 gram sodium oxalate say N1 Use this formula to calculate normality here. So, amount of sodium oxalate taken in gram is 0 0.1999 divided A minus B. Here, A is 29.5 ml minus B is 0 0.1 ml. Multiplied by 0 0.06701. which gives 0.1015 N, that is 0.1999 gram sodium oxalate solution consumes 29.5 ml potassium permanganate from which normality of KMN4 solution is found to be 0.1015 N. Similarly, normality of KMN4 solution given by 0.1423 gram sodium oxalate say N2 which equals sodium oxalate taken in gram is 0 0.1423 divided by A minus B where A is 20.6 ml minus B is 0 0.1 ml multiplied by 0 0.06701 which gives 0 0.1036 n.
that is 0.1423 gram sodium oxalate solution consumes 20.6 ml potassium permanganate from which normality of KMnO4 solution is found to be 0.1036 n. Again, normality of KMnO4 solution given by 0.1004 gram sodium oxalate say N3 which equals sodium oxalate taken in gram is 0.1004 divided by A minus B where A is 14.7 ml minus B is 0.1 ml multiplied by 0.06701 which gives 0.1026 m. Normality of KMnO4 solution given by 0.0511 gram sodium oxalate say N4 which equals sodium oxalate taken in gram is 0.0511 divided by 0.0511 where A is 7.5 ml minus B is 0.1 ml multiplied by 0.06701 which gives 0.1031 N. Finally, normality of KMnO4 solution given by 0.0012 gram sodium oxalate solution say N5 which equals sodium oxalate taken in gram is 0.0012 divided by 0.0061 A minus B where A is 0.3 ml minus B is 0.1 ml multiplied by 0.0671 which gives 0.0895 N. Now, average the normalities given by different grams of sodium oxalate to find out actual normality of KMnO4. So, actual value of normality of KMnO4 say N which is average the value of individual normalities which equals 0.1015 plus 0.1036 plus 0.1026 plus 0.1031 plus 0.0895 divided by 5 which gives 0.1001 n. In this way, we can find out the new strength of potassium permanganate solution. Now, ml of KMnO4 required to prepare 1000 ml 50 ppm manganese stock solution is calculated by following formula. ml of KMnO4 equals 4.55 divided by actual normality of KMnO4 which is 0.1001 N. So, required ml of KMnO4 to prepare 1000 ml 50 ppm manganese stock solution equals 4.55 divided by actual normality of KMnO4 is 0.1001 which gives 45.5 ml.
So, we have to dilute 45.5 ml potassium permanganate solution in 1000 ml volumetric flux to prepare 50 ppm stock manganese solution. Finally, save your Excel sheet. Please watch the next video for the preparation of 50 ppm stock manganese solution for the measurement of manganese in water by power sulfate method. Thanks for watching.